From a young age, I kept many diaries, and with time, writing was replaced by sketches. I integrated art into my daily expression and also noticed that I wasn't indifferent to the interest people showed in my artwork, so I decided to make it a bit more public. For example, drawing outside or in bars is always an adventure for me. I'm not necessarily guided by the desire to be famous, but the thought that drives me is indeed quite presumptuous. I often wonder, is art the reflection of the artist? Making art for me is always a way of learning something from myself, but above all from the world. This is why I disagree with the stereotype of the introverted artist that states that we make art to escape reality since the intention of my creation is precisely to bring me closer to it and to better understand it. Drawing helps me to express myself and therefore to communicate with this external universe which my great curiosity drives me to observe. It is this delicate balance between discovering yourself through observing the world around you and representing it through your own gaze that I find the most fascinating. I cultivate an endless love for the art of sketching mostly urban landscapes and humans, to capture the movement, the changes, the life, either in a totally realistic way or by purifying and creating a more illustrative rendering. I have also noticed lately that I take pleasure in designing paintings with a blurred aesthetic, layering techniques, experimenting with textures to create a certain orderly chaos. I don't view inspiration as a linear phenomenon, meaning that something can inspire not specifically to represent this thing, but purely to take a pen and a sketchbook and start creating.